Ah, hello and greetings, friends. This is, well, you know who I am, so I'm not going to say it. But this time we are playing um, another roguelike. I'm just, the, the new system is taking a while to come, a bit longer than I expected. So I decided just to play another roguelike. We're going to be, this is Cataclysm. It is a roguelike um, zombie game. It's pretty awesome. It's based around like Great Britain. So, oops, did not want to do that. Let's let's go back. Yeah. Whoops. Okay, new game. We're going to do a random character here. I don't know. I just like doing random characters and stuff. I'm not going to have a lengthy intro or anything. Um Yeah, I'm not going to be using my name for characters anyway. I have a, like a list of character names I'm just going to use. So, um I'm sorry for just jumping into this. I've had a busy day today, so I'm not, I'm kind of, you know, buzzed, or however you say it. High on stimulants, I guess that's the word. No, we're not going to be Barry, we're going to be Larry. Larry America, this time. Um, just going to be a character name, Larry America. And we'll see what we get. So if you've never seen this game before, it's fairly popular. popular. It's been done a couple of times. Um, there's my dog. Okay, yeah. I, I forgot the controls a lot. There's some sneakers on the ground. Uh, we might pick, the, pick those up. Um, let's see. So I'm pretty sure it's E. Yeah. There's cargo pants. We're going to pick those up. We're going to snatch those. Some under the hood, some books. Um, I don't think we're going to pick up, but we are... Uh, Okay, um, next, there's an MP3 player. I'm gonna grab that. So basically the game starts off, you're, um, you're pretty much trying to survive in a... I'm gonna pick up the lighter. You're trying to survive in a zombie world filled with um, death and destruction. We're gonna pick up the cigarettes too. And what's this over here? Eyeglasses. Well first off, let's see, if you do shift one, that's run. Shift two is this. Our, we have a heartless trait which probably makes us helps us killing things and the game doesn't really have a it's kind of an open world it doesn't really have a story yet there it does start out with all these different factions you can try and find them they have the republic of gen gen qua the stone men of malhit the Mumi monks and a whole bunch of thugs of quan quapon call i guess these pluses or doors the so yeah, we can just walk through them. You can also close them behind you by going like that, pressing C and closing them. It didn't close because the dog was right there. There we go. Get out of my way, butt. Let's see, plastic bottle of water. Yeah, no, we're running out of volume and we do not want to, but I'm gonna pick up this water. We struggle to carry the weight. Oh yeah, let's put on those um, cargo pants. That will definitely help. Yeah, it's been a while since I've recorded too, so you're already wheeling that. No, I want to wear it. There we go. Put on your cargo pants. Now we should be able to pick up stuff more easily. I'm going to pick up the cardboard box of frozen dinners, maybe munch on those a bit. Let's see. Yeah, get some V8, help the help grow those, grow, tone the muscles. No, we can't, we can't pick up all the, all the cardboard boxes. There we go. And I think that's it for now. If you press M, and there's the map of the world that you know, the city, and a whole bunch of a whole bunch of houses out here. We got a bar. Maybe we can pick up some some alcohol over there. A hardware store. I think we're gonna slide down there. A library, clothing store. Yeah, I think we're gonna hit down there. See if we can get a backpack. See if we can get some other stuff to survive in this cruel world. So yeah, we're just gonna run down the road. With our trusty companion best friend at the side and I do not want to check for solutions windows thank you there is some kind of what is this a grocery store yeah we're no I think we're good on groceries for now I don't want to I'm full on volume so I'm trying to hit hit up that clothing store down here let's see where was it um, pharmacy yeah yeah this is a really good row of sporting goods where's that clothing store am I just missing it Am I passing it up? Oh, it's up here, okay. Clothing store, yeah, right there. We're gonna go up, and soon enough we'll be running into those green 
those green beasts. And speak of the devil, there they are. Let's see, where is it? It's sunny. It's 66 Fahrenheit. It's spring, day one. The time is 8.32 a.m. The dog is running up there. I'm going to play in the yard, and yeah, there's the zombies. My dog is going to throw its life away from me. An honorable dog. And holy cow, I ran into a horde. We're going to slide away from them, see if we can escape their treachery. And yeah, I'm right next to the clothing store, so we're going to see if we can bust our way in there. We don't have a weapon yet, so that's not really why I'm trying to stop and uh, fa try and face the zombies. Not like I was going to try to anyways. You only really do that when... Um, when you're well enough equipped. Let's see what we got in here. A sweatshirt, no, we're not, we're men. We can handle the cool, the cool climates. Leather pants, no. We're not gonna be a street biker today. Hoodie, sweat, yeah, we're gonna pick up the hoodie. I'm pretty sure that um, nearby a zombie, yeah, there's a zombie to our, to our southeast. I have to think about my directions, as usual. Um, yeah, so we're going to put on these, um, sorry if I'm saying um a lot. Let's see, we're going to, oh, we're very hampered. And that is not a good thing. But it does give us more room. And I think we got what we came for. So we're going to, we're going to dupe the zombie down there, lock it in, and let's get out of here. Let's see. Where is our next stop? Not the Twilight Zone, but yeah, there's the hardware store right there. We're going to see if we can march over there. You know, the zombies are trailing us from behind. We're going to see if we can... Yeah, we climb or walk on the fence and... I do not want to get surrounded, so... <laughs> yeah, F that noise. Let's... Yeah, okay, we're going to see what we can do about these zombies. See if we can escape their wrath. And yeah, we're going cli to throw climb in here, see if we can get a spy novel. No, from... A spy novel from like the 50s. Let's see broom. Yeah, we're actually going to pick that up. We're going to wield it, too. Where is it? Broom. Other. There we go. Our weapon is the broom. A very effective weapon. The 2x4. We are going to snatch that and... Okay. Time for some combat. Time for some fisticuffs. And, yeah, we're getting surrounded down here. So we're going to run out. Sorry, if I, I seem a bit calm right now. I'm, I'm kind of relaxed. Even though I said I was up on stimulants, or whatever, coffee, if, if you will. I'm, a, I'm just pretty awake. That's pretty much it. And at the same time, I'm I'm kind of exhausted. But I, Holy cow. That is that is just terrifying. Yeah. I'm just... Um, as for the new system, I already have an idea. I'm going to be playing a couple of SNES games, a couple of... Um, I already have a few Steam games in mind, and as for the Steam games, even though they will probably be more mainstream, I will definitely... Oh, there's a human corpse, an ID card, perhaps a scientist who is trying to save the world. He failed his mission, but perhaps we can iodine type. Let's say, yeah, we're going to pick up a lot of this. Not the Aminia, we don't need that. Medical gloves, yeah, we can be a doctor. Some RAM. I would love some RAM for my computer. Um, inhaler, we do not need that. Goo canister, internal batteries, a dusk mask. You know, we're going to pick up the ID card, and I think that's just about it. See if that gets us anywhere in the world. A glass bottle of... We're going to drop that. No, I don't want to drop that. Pick it up. Okay. Um, there's the ID card. Yeah, I picked up... I do not want to drink some mutagen. That is not very healthy. I at least think so. I'm, I'm pretty sure. Maybe. Maybe some people can handle it. It's like smoking pro puffs. You just gotta be pro enough to smoke the toxic cigarettes. Um, I'm gonna go up there to the bar, see what kind of alcohol we can get our hands on. 